Hello everyone, my name is Scorpion Games and today we're going to be carrying on with Dynasty Warriors 2 and this is going to be Mission 4 of the Story Mode. Now I'm really excited now because these missions are the missions that I haven't played in over 10 years and I'm so looking forward to playing them again, seeing what which battles they were, seeing which characters we're going to be facing, so let's get straight into it. Continue. Battle of Yiling, so I think this is against Wu, if I remember correctly. I'm counting on you, Lu Xun. Any time now. I forgot how short those cutscenes actually are in this game. I thought they were a lot longer than that. But oh well. So yeah, I was correct. We're facing the Wu forces on this mission. So it's Shu versus Wu. And I'll play here the background before we start. At Changban, Liu Bei barely escapes with his life. Joining forces with Sun Quan, he manages to destroy Cao Cao's pursuit. At the same time, he regains control of Jing. They call this the Battle of Qi Bi. With Jing as a base, Liu Bei turns west to Shu. Winning control of Shu, he is finally in a position to begin Zhu Ge Liang's Heavenly Triangle. However, Sun feels threatened by Bei's growth. He allies with Wei, and together they seize control of Jing. A furious Bei swears revenge. By 221, Bei's army had been attacking Yi Ling Castle for a year. The men are exhausted and so worn out that at first they do not notice Wu's counterattack. Okay, so that's a bit of the background of the Battle of Yi Ling. So, there's a famous battle in the Old Dynasty Warriors, which I think you only play as if if you're a Wei character or a Wu character. And they mentioned that story of the Battle of Chi Bi, which is always set on a ship or loads of ships. So I think, because I'm a Shu character, I may have skipped that one out, so... I, thought, I, I actually thought that was going to be the next mission, but I was wrong because I think I'm a Shu character. So, let's have a look at the Allies. So it's the Shu character, so Liu Bei. There's there's no playable characters on the officers on, on for Liu Bei. There's a character called Wei Yan, who's an officer with Zhao Yun. I don't think he is a playable character in this game, but he is insane. I love Wei Yan. I think he's so cool to play as. He's he's a bit different than everybody else because he he talks in a weird way. When we get to do this way it's free, I'll show you what I mean, but he is so cool. I think He's a character who I forgot about as well, and I tend to overlook him, but he's really good. So I can't wait to see him in this way as free as, as his player model. Then there's me, and as you can see, there's, uh, I've got all my... I think I think there's one more missing of my siblings, but none of them have uh, player models in this game. So there's Guanping, Guan Xing, and Guan Su Suo. In the later games, they all have player models, and you can play as all of them. They all tend to be a bit, I don't know, they, they, they seem to be characters that I'm never really drawn to, the siblings of Guan Yu, apart from Guan Ping, because he was the first sibling to become a playable character out of Guan Yu's siblings, and they give him like a giant sword, which this massive sword which was a bit different, so that made him appealing, but the rest of them, I don't know, I, I don't think I've tried them enough to, to judge them, so, but... I'm not, like I said, I'm not really drawn to them as characters on the later games, but on, on this game they're not they're not playable, so it doesn't really matter. Zhang Fei, he doesn't have any playable characters on his officers, and there's Zhuge Liang, who's an officer by himself on this game, on this on um, this battle. Ma Chao, who is my favourite character in these stories, he's actually. I was thinking that the, when I was when they mentioned in the last video, who when I asked you guys what's your favourite character. I was thinking who mine was, and I've always, I've always been drawn to Mar, Mar Chow. I think he's really, he's, he's always been, in my opinion, he's always been the fastest character to use. But he's still a tank, so he's, he's got the speed and he's got the strength to him as well. So, and his special, his special moves are always really cool. And if, if you follow Dennis Royce, you know what Mar Chow looks like. His armor looks so cool. And they're going back to his original armor on Dennis Royce Nine, so I'm looking forward to that so much. And there's an officer there called Ma Dai, who is 
now a playable character from Dynasty Warriors 6 onwards, I think. He, I don't know, he's a bit ridiculous because his, his weapon is like a, it's like a giant paintbrush and he uses that as like a sword and it's a bit stupid really, I don't know. It doesn't really seem cool or any, for me anyway, I, I, I don't know, so I'm, I'm not, never really drawn to him. But he's not a playable character on this, so I don't need to worry. Wang Zhong, who is uh, a playable character in this game, who we've not seen yet. He is, I think he's like the oldest character to pick from in Dynasty Warriors. And he uses a bow and arrow as his weapon. I can't remember if he does in this game, actually. I think he does, I think he does, because I can't remember him never not using the bow and arrow. So, he, he's cool because I like his weapon. Um, He's not, he's not one of my favourites, but, but he's alright. He's alright. So that's it for Chu, and then that's it for the enemies. Sun Quan, who is the leader of Wu at this point. Uh, when we did the the Yellow Turbans and who are Gate missions, there was uh, Sun Jian who was the leader. And if you play through the story as a Wu character, you you know that Sun Jian dies and Sun Quan's son takes over. So that's why Sun Jian's not there anymore. And Sun Shang Xiang, who was on the one of the characters on the select screen at start. Zhao Tai, who is so cool. I love Zhao Tai. He's um, kind of like a samurai type of character. He has a samurai sword and he's just, everything about him is really cool. Like the way he talks and everything. And if, you, if you're if you on the, the Koei official Facebook page, they've been doing these votes every week to vote for who your favorite character is on the faction. And Zhao Tai was voted the Everyone, uh, the most favourite character on Wu. I'm glad because he's so cool. Um, uh, I'm like, like when I've seen these characters now, I'm still torn between who I'm going to pick on Dynasty Warriors 3 to play as, and I keep changing my mind because I keep seeing these characters pop up. I'm like, oh, they're so cool. Like that, they're just in Wei Yan and Zhou Tai now, so still undecisive with that. Hang Dang, who's not a playable character on this game, but he is on Dynasty Warriors 8 onwards. Zhou Yu, the officer he has isn't a playable character. Lu Jun, he was on the he was on the start screen. I think Zhu Ron is a playable character now on the most more recent games. Tai Shi Shi, he's very good. Uh, he's he's one of he's one of the most like tankiest, strongest characters on Wu because he uses his two back like long maces that are really cool. He's quite slow but he's very powerful, and he also has really cool armor. Uh, Ding Feng is also a, a playable character on the later games, but he's not on this one. Uh, is that everyone? Lu Meng, he is he's a character who I always I always overlooked for a lot of the early games. I never really thought much of Lu Meng, but for some reason the later games I've been drawn to him. I don't know why. He's like one of those characters who he's he's got his story in the Dynasty Warriors. There's nothing really much to it. And it, but for some reason, it kind of makes him quite mysterious, and I don't know. That's kind of drawn to me in the later games, and he kind of and he looks really cool in the later games. They made his spear a lot longer, so it's like a big giant spear he's holding, which was so cool. And then there's Ling Tong, who's not a playable character in this game. He becomes a playable character from six onwards, and he has cool nunchucks as his weapon, which makes him so cool, and he's really fast. And I'm a big fan of Bruce Lee, so I'm automatically drawn to anyone with nunchucks. So he's cool. Gan Ning, he's awesome on this game and this way he's free. On the games after that, he kind of got a bit outshined, but for some reason on this game, I think he's the best character to use on this on this way's two and possibly free. Because his special move, if you if you max out his Musuyu bar, he basically runs with he runs as he's doing his super attack. So if you've got that really high, you can run through loads of enemies until your Missouri bar runs out and it's so powerful. And I think on Dynasty Warriors 3, you unlock an ability where your super attack becomes on fire and you set the enemies on fire when you do your super attack. And that move with the fire is so cool. That's one of my that's one of my more, more strongest memories of playing Dynasty Warriors as a kid, doing that with Ganding. So I'm looking forward to seeing Ganding. And that's it for Cheng Pu, and there's one guy, there's a lot of officers to face on this one, so we're going to try and kill them all like always to get the most stats as possible. 
then uh, at this that's my rank now first south general and my guards have ranked up again since the last mission so they're going to be very overpowered it's going to make life a bit easier for me but they do get in the way it pushes me off conditions to defeat Sun Quan and we lose if Lu Bei gets defeated or if I die so it's enough talking to get into the mission already. So Lu Meng must have been right next to us. There's that cutscene activated straight away. What's going on? Right into it here to begin with. Fucking hell. It shouldn't be any problem because I don't think there's, there's no other officers like Lu Bu was where he 10 times overpowered the rest so I should get through these with these now. Unless something very drastic happens. Has he gone? Because look at that, one hit and I'm doing like half the damage now. So it looks like there's a lot of uh, fucking ambushes going on for this mission. Oh, I remember what you e Lang was now. This, 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 uh, played in this game, this is the one with that weird maze on the map, because as you can see on the left of the mini map there's like a weird maze thing going on there, that's always on this, this type of map. I don't, I don't know if it does it on this game, uh, but on the later games if you run into that your mini map disappears, so you get kind of lost and you have to keep going to the pause menu to see where you are. Where did Joe you go? Try and keep red hair this time, or I was end up fucking losing him. Where did he go? I must have killed him. So let's go up and defeat Lu Meng. There's Ling Tong, as you see, he's not a playable character in this game. Missing the, the nunchucks. So we're in the way. Okay, Liu Meng should be up here. I think. Yeah, he's there. It looks a lot different than I remember on this game. Don't remember, don't remember him having that ponytail. So that's the end of Lu Meng's story for Dennis Royce 2, so that lasted long, didn't it? Fucking hell. I thought at least he'd be on some other missions after this, but no, he must. Dead already. Fucking hell. Mar Shao has begun battle with Tai Chi and Shi. That'd be pretty cool. Both cool characters. Did I kill Zhou Yu? I, I, must, have did, I must have done it without noise, because I don't remember killing him. Somewhat. Yep, must have killed him. Don't need to save because I'm not going to die on this mission. Go back and get red hair and fuck off. Or nick, nick someone's horse. Or have I lost the fucking horse again? Like always. Where is he? <laughs> I've lost the horse again. I'm pretty sure I disappears, I don't fucking care. It's happened to every single mission. Don't be wasting my time with these guys. Hang on. Uh, I'll go back up and I'll go around the other way because I don't want to go down there too early. Go and kill the people to the to the centre of the map first. But they're past my horse again on the way back. Where is it? What's going 
Ham. Shit, so there's another ambush down there, wherever it is. Looks like they've set the that base down there on fire. Which has probably reduced the health of all the Allied officers. So we're on the fucking horses gone. Right, let's just make our way down there now, unless somebody up no running if someone was near the top. I'm coming. Shut up. I'll get them, they'll be on full health, I'll tell you now. There'll be nothing wrong with them. Yeah, the weather's changing quite quickly. So there's Ganning, he's, so, he's proper calling his old games. I think they changed his weapon on some of the recent games, which made, again made him less healing than, than he did on these games. I just, I just remember him being very fun to use on these early games, especially with that special move. Come here. Has he not hit anybody? Sorry, Gandhi. But Ganding's dead already, so... I think it's because it skipped a lot of missions because I'm not a Woo character. There is a lot more to his... He has a lot more scene time if you are a Woo character or if you're a certain character on maybe Wei or even Shu where you do different missions. So I think there are like with like with Zhou Yu, Zhao Yun and Zhuge Liang, I think you would go and do the Battle of Chibi because they're very important on that on that, on that mission, even though I'm a Shu character and I've skipped that mission. I, think, I don't think Guan Yu is is on that mission, so that's why I've skipped it. There's Tash, you see, with his, uh, he's got like two battle rods, which is cool. Or they two swords, no, they were two battle rods, I thought they were two swords. Then. Stop recovering. Is he dead as well? Oh, no. So we're wiping out a lot of the Wu forces here. Let's nick his horse. This horse here. There's Mar Marshall there. Yeah, with a cool dragon armor. That's fucking cool. Uh, right, let's go down here. Come in. Yeah, it's very hard to see with the rain and the fog. Yeah, so they set the base on fire down here. That's probably why he's in trouble because it probably reduced his health. Where's the way in? Okay. I've just got deja vu then just from going around this corner. I don't know what. Fucking hell, that was, that was weird. Blue June. Looks a lot cooler on these older games than he does in the new ones. Kill this guy first. Just quick. That was Lu Jun. Yeah, 
Oh my god, I got him. That's crazy. In the wet fog. There he is, there he is. Oh my god, that's so cool. <laughs> I just love the purple on their armor, I think that's a really nice touch to it. Nice. Bit of an overkill there, but then... Okay, where's the defense of plus four? That's really handy. Okay, it's two more to the right, and then we'll head off to turn one. Um, split up here now. It's better now to see a bit better. Yeah, see, one guy isn't a playable character in this game. Looks completely different to that on the rest of the games. I think one of our allies just died then to Zhou Tai. What capture it was then? On that, on this bit. Let's go up and kill Zhou Tai. I can't actually remember if he is a player of character. I think he is. Where is he? No, he's not. I might even play as short time and this way it's free. I have to remember him. There's a guy up here. As my child's in trouble. Plus, he's just struggling with these weapons. Yeah, he is. It's not bad, okay, Let's start going down here. Oh, no. Shit. Ah. Ignore these guys. Who's this? Oh my god, man, I got this look the last touch in there. the gate captain, get his defence up. Ah, fucking bomb. Where the fuck that ball with me again? Over here. Don't knock me off that one. How many more officers there? They're all just in there, in there so I'll try and kill all of them before killing Tom Clan. Female officers, fucking hell, forgot about, forgot about them. The, the uh, 
Look, the, the females. I forgot about that. Wow. <laughs> oh, that's weird. Sure, they're not. They're not on free. Not be wrong. Ooh! Look, my health meter has just increased in size now, so got more health. I'm sure you can get them in boxes, but I haven't. I'm sure I've, I've seen every box on every map when it wasn't in it. You don't even know. He's dead. Ah. He's surrounded, so he's used it. Get off your horse. Is that all of them? Yeah, it's all of them. I wonder if he's got any... I've just killed her, so that hasn't gone off yet. So it's just some one to go for. Cool character. I do, I do like Sun Quan. I like, especially his uh, in the later games. You know, I think his sword is really cool. Get off. Come back. Oh my god! Oh. Seems quite strong actually. Oh fuck it up! Got me. It does seem quite strong. So if I was doing this without ranking up a couple for the Kill Seven mission, this would be fucking well different. Look at that. You can't hold it. Kill this gate captain first. I think I might kill him up to some sort of spawning in. Heal. Stop blocking. Pretty sure I was hitting him. Doing this and just pressing X now. Don't knock him off the corner, guard, I'll kill you. <laughs> is he gonna keep healing him up? Look at that! Why is he doing that? I think this is because it's on normal, I think that they heal a lot more than they would have on easy. This is ridiculous. My phone is actually hurting me because of X. Shit, he's run out. Get him, get him back in the door. 
Yeah, let's get back in that car. Awesome fun. There we go. Okay. Bit of a dumb way to kill him, but never mind. And Sun Quan is dead. So is that the last battle against Wu? Pretty sure there's another one after this. Did Zhou Yu die? Can't remember if he ran off or not. Don't even remember killing Zhou Yu. I must have done a bit. Okay. So we're getting even stronger. Look at all the officers are killed. So I'll fuck you now. Okay. We're going to rank up again. Yeah. I think the guards are at its last rank now, so they won't they won't rank up anymore. And I won't get any more than eight. So that's going to be end of mission four of Dynasty Warriors two. Next is going to be mission mission five. I don't know what the next mission is. I forgot what it is. So. I'm looking forward to seeing what that is. So thanks for watching guys and I'll see you.